A shocking and offensive video circulating online. A woman's racist rant targeting a Lower East Side bagel shop employee over wearing a mask. And now we're hearing from that employee. News Force Miles Miller is on the Lower East Side right now with the way the woman in the video appears to be justifying her outburst. Miles. Well, Chuck, she says she was having a bad day and she says she can use that racial slur because she herself is a black woman. The target of a racist tirade at a Lower East Side bakery speaking out for the first time. Vic was behind the counter at Davidovich Bakery on Sunday with a line full of customers when he saw this woman identified as Stephanie DeNaro causing quite a stir by refusing to wear a mask. Excuse me, I think you might have forgotten your mask and um, you should probably wear your mask. She replied to me saying, who am I to ask her that question and why am I asking her that question and followed with... Uh, all the slurs that she uh, she had said. Security at Essex Market told the mother of five she had to mask up or leave. Denaro unloaded, upsetting Vic. I really felt offend offended by those words. Denaro was home when News 4 paid her a visit, but she told us she isn't talking to anyone. She's been posting on Instagram, all in an effort to justify her actions. In one post, noting, quote, I was having a bad day. I didn't want to put a mask on because I have asthma and bronchitis. No one understood me, so I got mad, end quote. Denaro claims a DNA test shows she is black. In several other posts, she has called the coronavirus pandemic a hoax and has protested against the state's mask mandate. Yes, Vic's message to Denaro is simple. Love o o overcomes, you know, hatred and whatever she might have felt on that time. An executive at the bakery here has lauded Vic for the way that he handled all of this. In her latest post, that woman says she has a daughter who is of mixed ethnicity, and she found no problem with what her mother said. We're live on the Lower East Side tonight. I'm Miles Miller, News 4. Back to you.